speak like a furry. After you hit subscribe, don't forget to hit the notification bell as well as stay tuned at the end of the video for the question of the day. Damn. What's going on my fellow Plus Bucks? Zombo the Circle here in the back with another video just to educate my people. And today we're kicking off with another episode of the episode, 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 installment of the Speak Like a Furry series. And the uh the word of choice for today is gray muzzle. Say it with me! Gray muzzle. And this term is used to identify one of two things. Either A, someone in the fandom that has been in the fandom for an extended period of time. We'll say like at least, you know, eight, nine plus years, something like that. Or somebody who is generally above the age of 30 that joins the fandom. This does not dictate that you have to meet one or two of these criteria in order to be considered a gray muzzle. A gray muzzle, just like many other things in this fandom, are all subjective. If you consider it, then therefore it is. Like, that's like the main concept behind most of, you know, the concepts behind the furry fandom. There's been some misconceptions with some people saying that in order to be considered a gray muzzle, you have to be born, like, in the 70s. But, like, given our current year, if you were born in the 70s, that means that, you know, you're... You're, you're, you're pretty up there. That's like, hmm, what's it? That'd be 40-ish. Yeah, that's like 40s going on 50s. And although that would make you a gray muzzle, you don't have to be quite of that age to be considered a gray muzzle. Like I say, the general concept is somewhere after 30. So that lets you have like a little bit of wiggle room. Though also, whenever people have been in the fandom for an exterior for an extended period of time, they can also consider themselves gray muzzles because for all the new people coming in, they have like a certain level of knowledge above them and they like can be like the mentors or the mediators of the furry fandom for the newcomers in the fandom. Now, as far as like finding out who the gray muzzles are and who they aren't, that is, you know, completely up to the person because some people they can say like in the description of insert random social media here, Twitter for example, like in their description they can say that they are a gray muzzle. I don't know if people generally do this because some people like to, you know, conceal their identities and their ages and all that stuff, even though you don't even have to um, put your age on the forefront in that fashion. <laughs> if you just, you know, rep the Grey Muzzle title, then that can show the people around you that, hey, I've been in the fandom for, you know, a good amount of time, and, and if there's anything that you need to know, just let me know, and I can help you out with that situation, which is something that people should probably start doing. That way, you know, if people are just now entering the fandom, and, you know, they want to just figure some things out and, like, get a better understanding as to what we do in the good old community of the Fuzzbots! then yeah, the Grey Muzzles is a great, 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 great thing to reach out to. <laughs> but as far as Grey Muzzles go, that's pretty much like the main general concept. It's just someone who's a little bit older in the fandom or someone who has, you know, been in the fandom for an extended period of time. That doesn't mean that, oh, I have to be 30 to be considered a Grey Muzzle. Like, you could have joined the fandom at 14 and you're like, you know, 20 something now. And like that experience that you've accumulated over time that could make you fall into the requisition of gray muscles. But like I say, it's all in whether or not you consider yourself to be one. Because you can say, oh, I've been in the furry fandom for like 25 years and you're like, but I don't really consider myself a gray muzzle. I don't like that title. That's all well and good because it's all up to you. Yeah. Also, according to the, uh, what they said on the fur affinity page, the definition, mis like, even though I'll be 25 this year, I've been in the fan- next year I'll be in the fandom for nine years. If I wanted to, I'd consider myself a gray muzzle, but I probably wouldn't until I probably hit, like, 35-ish. 35? I already feel old. I don't want to feel older. <laughs> Yeah, like I say, it's all subjective. You know, if you consider it, then therefore it is. Because, like, you know, somebody could do the thing where, you know, you're representing the gray muzzle and they come at you with all these, you know, topics and stuff that happened, like, way back in the day. And you're like, I'm actually just new here. And they're like, oh, you call yourself a gray muzzle? How dare you? You're bamboozling. <laughs> but yeah, heckin' bamboozling. <laughs> yes, there are... <laughs> There are people in the fandom that will do that, you know, they'll they'll get a little bit snappy. I've dealt with that personally, but we won't get into that right now. I might actually make a story time about that little incident. Some people might already know what it is, and of course I'll change the names of these people, but 
yeah, I'll go ahead and uh, <laughs> I'll set that for another set in another station. But for right now, I'm going to go ahead and close this. So, if you like this video, go ahead and scratch that like button so that I can go to post my awesome content in the future. Also, if you have some questions about some stuff that's within the furry fandom, like terms and such, that you want more information on, then definitely post them down in the W below. And, you know, I can probably share my thoughts on it. I'll make videos about it. You know, something like that. It might happen. But yeah, want to talk to me? Have some Twitter. You want to stay updated as well as know what the next Q&A is going to be? Have for Infinity. Want to drop fan artists off of the circle? Fan artists, always welcome. Keep it PG-13. But as always, my name is Abba the circle, and I'm out of here. la 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 Question of the day. How old are you? If you're willing. Post your comments down there in the dibble below and I'll share my age with you guys and stuff. Wah!